this is Bill from Great Lakes Bee Supply in Galesburg, Michigan. Today we're going to show you how to start a smoker and try to keep it running. It's always been a problem. Smokers go out about halfway through your hive inspections and it's a nuisance to stop and have to get them fired up again. So we're going to show you how to do it. It usually works. This will burn for probably in the area of two hours. First thing to start with is pine needles. The pine needles come from a white pine. They're the needles that are long. The little short Christmas tree needles don't work near as good as white pine needles. You hold your needles in a ball and get ready to stick it in your smoker. You can light it with a match, but it's easier to light it with a propane torch. Light your needles. Get the needles going in your smoker. Puff it a little bit to make sure it keeps going. The trick with a smoker is you've got to pack these needles down in there real well and real tight. If you have a bunch of air in there, what will happen is, is that the needles will burn up too fast or it will flare out and the end of your smoker will start shooting fire out. You need to do this usually with your gloves on because your hand's going down into the fire. I will usually put about a third of the pine needles in the bottom of this, pack them down in there. Then what I will do is grab some smaller sticks from limbs that have fallen off a pine tree. Something that gives it a little more thickness and depth to the heater. Jam those in. Jam the sticks down into the smoker. Don't be afraid to push them right down in there hard. If you have tufts off a pine tree like this, those work great. Push them right in there and push them right down. Keep it smoking. Might want to put a few more needles in. What you're trying to do is sandwich needles and hard material in layers in there. Then as the layers burn through, the soft, fluffy needles will start the harder wood and actually the next thing we're going to put in are a couple pine cones. These are pine cones that came off a white pine tree. Pine pine cones will work really well. They're just little tinder things, but they're tougher and will burn longer. You can put two or three in. There again, we go back to the layering. We put some more pine needles in. Maybe a little more wood in. Maybe another pine cone in. Just like baking a cake. And then fill the top up with your pine needles. and just pack them in there. You don't have to worry about it being too tight because you remember the smoker has an air aerator panel on the bottom of it that makes it so you can't clog up the hole as it puffs through. Clean the And you can set right there and it looks like it's out. It's not. It's burning down in the bottom. Right now it looks like I got just about enough right to the top. Now I have solid material in there and I have pine needles in there. So you can just puff it to get it going a little bit. Click your lid down and you're ready to go. This will last right around two hours and basically it does not go out because the pitch in the needles and the pine cones 
make an ember in there and keeps it going rather than newspaper that just burns out and disappears. So give that a try. I know it works. You or your neighbors will probably have pine trees. The resources are cheap, simple, don't really have to buy anything, and it works. So hopefully this has been some good advice from Great Lakes Bee Supply in Galesburg, Michigan. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Mm-hmm.